Welcome, 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 Tanya's Tarot. Come on in, my loves. We're going to jump into another Divine Connection read. Let's see what's going on for you guys at this time. Come on in. Get your sh and get comfortable. The flags are flying. They're loud. I sing, I curse. If any of this is a problem, now would be the best time for you to go ahead and click off. If not, we're going to jump into this and see what message Spirit has for our divine connections today. What is going on for the divine connections? Twin flames, twin rays, divine partners, life partners, high level soulmates, karmics. What is the situation? Okay, so there is someone here remembering the past. This could be you. This could be someone um, around you. They could be listening to music. And the songs that are playing has them in their feelings and their emotions right now. They're thinking about you. Yeah, see, this is somebody that you don't trust anymore. It says, I don't trust him or her when you're not around. So, this is someone that broke your trust. And however they broke your trust in the past, they're thinking about this. They're thinking about what they did to you. They could be listening to songs, to music here. That has them all in their feelings and their emotions. One more here for my divine connection. They gave us two. So we'll take these two. Yeah, whoever this is, they, they were on the down low. Um, they were keeping secrets to themselves here. They could have literally been on the down low. Um, or they just weren't honest about their lifestyle. They could have been a player. Okay. Um... They could have been bisexual. They could have been dealing with both men and women. And they weren't honest about their lifestyle here. But for others, I just feel like there was a playboy or a playgirl. They were out here doing their thing. And they wasn't honest. Okay? Yeah. And and I feel like this was a decision that they... They, they consciously made this decision... To not be faithful. Okay. Now they could be sitting back smoking or drinking or trying to escape whatever they do to escape here. Yeah. Um. They could be missing you at this time. They could be talking to their family members. Their family members could tell them they're stronger than what than they know and that they got their back at this time. Yeah, because this person is missing this loss. They're feeling the loss of you, loved one or a lover here. Yeah, so this is a past lover or a loved one that is missing you, okay? Their choices and their decisions, the things they did behind your back, the things they did on the down low, the secret shit they did, um, this person should have been honest. And now they're regretting the choices and decisions that they made about not being honest or whatever they did behind your back here. Because whatever they did messed up your trust. You don't trust this person as far as you can see him. And this could be somebody from your past. Somebody that you walked away from. But I feel like they knew exactly what they were doing. Like they didn't care. Collective divine connections. Clarify this remembering the past. What is this? You, I told you, I told you. This is, I knew exactly what I was doing. Whoever this is, they're thinking about what they did, the choices and decisions that they made behind your back. Okay? The reasons why you don't trust them. But they knew exactly what they were doing when they did it. They didn't care. They knew they that they were destroying your trust clarify i don't trust him or her when you're not around clarify i don't trust him or her when you're not around now they want to come in it says i want to give you all my love every little bit every part of me now they want to come in and give you their love but you don't trust this person because whatever they did in the past they could have really hurt you okay they could they could have um physically emotionally verbally harmed you in some type of way here 
They could have put you in third party situations. They could have lied. Whatever it was, they did it knowing exactly what they were doing. It was a conscious decision and they did not care about your feelings. Now they want to come back and want to love on you. Clarify down low. I should have been truthful about my lifestyle. Clarify down low. I should have been truthful about my lifestyle. Let me take these two. Whoever this is, they use sex as a weapon. So they could have slept with someone else. Okay? It was a sexual connection. Yeah. They're hiding shit and keeping big secrets. They're hiding the fact that they set, they had sex with somebody. Possibly somebody that you know. Possibly somebody that lives with you. Or someone they were living with. Because it says house changes. So they could have been living with someone. They could have been in a sexual connection. They could have they could have had sex with someone that you live with. Or if you guys live together, you had a family member or someone staying with you, a friend coming over, they could have had um they could have had sex with somebody while they were living in your house here. See, now this person sees you shining. You out here successful. You're doing your shit. And now they're upset about the choices and decisions that they made. They are happy for your success. But now they wish they were with you. Yeah, you could have just bought you a Mercedes. Um, You could be driving a nice car even if it's not a Mercedes. You out here doing good. Yeah, this could be somebody in jail or somebody about to go to jail. It's going to jail for the BS they did to you. Okay, so this is this. If it's not real jail, they're going to spiritual jail. Whoever these people are here. But yeah, somebody did something behind your back. They were down low. They had sex with somebody that you knew. Could have possibly did it in your house behind your back. But they're hiding shit. Let's see. Clarify this down low. They're hiding shit. Sex is a weapon. This housing changes. Somebody could be moving out of a house. If they were in a, a connection with someone they were still having sex with. Maybe they weren't telling you that they live with this person. That could have been a secret. And now they want to come towards you, but you don't trust them. Maybe you found out they were living with somebody else. Clarify this down low. Clarify the down low. Sex as a weapon. Uh, they're receiving karma now. Bad karma. They're receiving bad karma for how they treated you. And now they want to come make it right. And you're receiving good karma. You're being successful. Clarify down low. Yeah, this person is angry all the time. They're angry all the time because they're receiving this karma for, for whatever they did behind your back. Clarify down low. Whoever this is, um, they could have had a toxic mom. They could have mommy issues here. But they're receiving karma. So maybe this is why they, they, they were sleeping with your friends or your family member behind your back because um, of their upbringing because they got childhood issues. <laughs> this is somebody, they slept with somebody here that didn't like you. But they know you. You know what I'm saying? This could be a friend that's secretly in your face. They they smiling and cheesing. But behind your back, they, they trying to fuck with your man. Or they trying to fuck with your girl. Right? Because it says tag team and seeking assistance for the hate. They got together and they would talk about you here. You know what I'm saying? They 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 talked about you. They They talk shit about you. They knew exactly what they were doing. So they would sit up and have sex, talk shit about you. Both of them possibly have toxic relationships with their parents. Anger issues and shit. Yeah. Whoever this is, they was over there showing your person what that mouth do. Man or woman. 
Yeah, and they're mad because you're keeping your distance now. You don't fuck around with either one of these people. So I feel like you walked away from whoever these people. Maybe you knew they had this connection already. Maybe you, you sensed it. Or maybe you just pulled away. But you're not dealing with whoever these people are. And now they want to come back. We'll just keep your distance. Maybe you walked away from both of these people and they were mad and they decided to hook up. So this could be like an ex-friend and an ex. And they watching you have this success. And they hooked up. These people from your past though. People that you don't trust. You walked away from these connections because you don't trust them. You put distance between them. So they decided since you walked away from them that they was going to go and, and do this shit behind your back. And they talk shit about you. They planned this shit. They knew exactly what they were doing. This could be your friend. It says friends assisting with the hate. Taking turns looking on social media. So they sitting around watching you. Talking shit. Having sex. Behind your back. And you over here coming up. I got this man abused twice. Whoever this other female is. They could be over there beating on your ex. Or this ex will be beat on, on your female. Because they toxic. Yeah, and it was just sex, nothing more. This person could be mad because this this connection was just sex, nothing more. You can read tarot, they can read tarot. You can read tarot and, and bust the fact out that they got caught cheating. You might have found out through tarot that these people was cheating. You be finding out right now through tarot that these people is cheating behind your back. Yeah, whoever this is, they have some type of drug addiction. This could be your friend. This could be the the other person. But I feel like you know both of these people. You know these people. Yeah, they could even went to some type of spell worker to, to do some type of spell work against you. Because they didn't want you to move forward. They could have been pretending like they were happy for your success. They knew exactly what they were doing. And whoever this is, they're a liar. I do feel like this is a warning reading. Yeah, these people are materialistic. And you could have cut these people out your life. And they spying on social media. Pretending to be another on social media to spy on you. They trying to see what you got going on. We're going to throw some tarot on this real fast. And then we'll close this read up. This person could once again be locked up in jail. They could be in their head overthinking. This could have been somebody you were in a connection with. God could have stepped in here and prevented this shit. Because they're receiving karma right now. Bad karma. They're receiving bad karma for everything that they did to you. And now they're sitting back thinking about it. Reminiscing. Remembering. And I do feel like this is people that you know from your past. This could be people you grew up with in childhood. Exes from your past. This could be... Um, a long past, this could be recent past. Past is yesterday, okay? Five of Pentacles. This is somebody you walked away from. You left these people out in the cold. Okay? People from your past you're no longer dealing with. And they're mad. Yeah. These people could have gaslighted you. You know, came at, came at you with this bullshit fake love here. And you left their asses out in the cold. Yeah. And then they felt heartbroken. But they put you in a third party situation. It happened. Now they can't turn back the hands of time. Mm, mm, mm. Listen to what's planned. It happened. Now they can't turn it back. Mm -hmm. Yep, they stole that moment. I can't make this shit up. The eight of swords. Now they all up in their head. They forgot to face one simple fact that that this person belonged to you when um they started having this sexual connection. 
They they both possibly belong to someone else. They both could have been in a connection with someone else. One could have been in connection with you. The other one could have been in a connection with somebody else. But you know both of these people. I'm telling you. And I keep getting this jail. Somebody may literally be in jail. Or on their way to jail. If it's not literal jail, it could be spiritual jail. They're overthinking. They're, they're all in their head. They're trapped in their feelings and their emotions. Because they know they stabbed you in the back. And they want to come in and heal it. But I don't think you want to heal this with this person. You left the person down the call and you're leaving them. Yep, you, you're going your separate ways. And now this person sees you as their wish fulfillment. Whoever this was, they see you as wish fulfillment. They really want to come back towards you because whoever this friend was, it was just sex and nothing more. With you, it was emotions. Now they want to come towards you, the chariot. Cancer energy. We got a lot of Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio energy here. Um, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn energy. Now they want to come in quickly. Yeah, see, they, they as they laid in the past, yeah. This person wants to come towards you because they see you as a friend. They, they see you as someone they have an unbreakable bond with. They, they feel like you have a soul connection. But this person slept with your friend. Two of Cups is also the friend card. They slept with your friend. This could have been somebody you work with. And they went towards your friend very quickly. And I feel like they drove to your friend's house. They could have went out for drinks here. Maybe you were out of town or you were gone. Yeah, this person went over there. With they with they private parts in their hand ready. They weren't they were not worried about the hurt that it was gonna cause you. Now they're trapped in their head. Now they're in prison in their thoughts because of how they did you, because of their choices and decisions here. They never wanted to hurt you. They they know you would never understand. See now, now you've gathered your strength and you're moving on a new love. You gathered your strength up. You've healed from this and you've mo moving on to new love. You got brand new love coming in here for you, collective. Yeah, Queen of Pentacles, Page of Wands. This could have been somebody's baby's mother here. Somebody's wife, husband, somebody had a child with. For some of you guys. For others, this person sees you as wife material. Now they want to come towards you and put the action in. Now they want to come tell you the truth. This could be your baby's mother or baby's father that slept with one of your friends too, collective. And they've been trapped in their head in these thoughts. Because now they realize you are wish fulfillment. And now they want to come back towards this connection that you guys have after sleeping with your friend that was just sex. But you didn't you didn't heal from this. You've healed and you've moved on. You've been loving on yourself and you're finna walk into a brand new love connection here. Yeah, I see you blocking this. You've been very patient here. You see the lies, you see the deception, you see the third party situation here. This person wanna come in and tell you the truth, but like I said, they, they made a choice. They knew exactly what they were doing. I see you I see you remaining single, not dealing with this person here. I do see you moving forward to a brand new love here, a brand new connection. Are you already have walked into a new connection here? This person's going to be stressed. They're, they're, they're already stressed because they can't do anything but watch you now. The only thing they can do is watch from the background. And this is causing them a tower moment because you are getting this passion a new beginning. Okay, you are closed out a cycle with this person. And you're going to start something new here. They still want to come in and talk about the burdens. About how they were out here being a hoe. How they were manipulative and, and played these mind games. How they were given to other people besides just you. But they want to tell you that you made them happy. Yeah, they want to come in towards you. And they want to offer you. They want to come in quick, impulsive. And offer you some type of future. But they're still in this devil energy. Lower vibrational negative energy here. 
Keep your guard up. Be protective. Move forward. Stand in your power. Remember your self-worth and your self-love here. Yeah, this person's still going to constantly put you in third-party situations. And next time it may not be a friend, but it still will be a third party. Okay, guys. So I do feel like this could be a warning reading. Someone from your past is going to try to come back towards you here. Spirit says you you already healed from this. You stood in your power and move forward. Keep moving forward. Don't don't go backwards to this. But they're going to come in here. Okay, guys. But they had sex with your friend. Or someone they told you was just a friend. Okay, so if this resonates with you, let me know. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, and share. Until next time, you keep rocking with me. I'm going to keep rocking with you. Love, light, and peace. Bye, my TT babies.